Maseru, the capital of Lesotho in Southern Africa. Like many other rising cities in developing countries, Maseru faces the challenge to provide its inhabitants with safe water and improved sanitation services. To support the country's efforts to meet the Millennium Development Goals of increased access to clean water and sanitation services, the local water and sewage company Wasco proposed Maseru Waste Water Project to the European Investment Bank, the ACP EU Water Facility, and the Government of Lesotho to fund the implementation of the project. The aim of the project basically is part of the uh, international community to address the Millennium Goals. And the aim of the project is to cover the sanitation in the urban areas. The Tigelec group, as it has been said by the project, it's basically the, all Basotho who are residing within the urban center of Maseru. And it covers all spectra of our community, which is the those who are well off with the waterborne system, and also those who are not so well off with the sanitation system of ventilated improved pit latrines. The Maseru Wastewater Project is about the construction of uh, sewage systems or sanitation systems in Maseru. It's composed of uh, three works packages which are mainly the construction of sewer lines, the rehabilitation of Rajomose uh, treatment works, the construction of two wastewater treatment works, and also the construction of one-site sanitation facilities. As earlier indicated, Masuru Wastewater Project is divided into three separate works contracts. Works Contract 1, Construction of Ventilated Improved Pit Latrines. Works Contract 2, construction of new Acre College wastewater treatment works and upgrades to the existing Rajamose wastewater treatment works. Works contract three initially comprised of rehabilitation, upgrading and construction of sewer networks and pumping stations in Rajamose and Acre College catchments. Rajamose works in this contract was substituted by the construction of Masue wastewater treatment works. Works Contract 1 entails community mobilization and sensitization for hygiene education, as well as a door-to-door -door survey, and finally to facilitate the construction of on-site sanitation facilities. Technologies for economic development and NGO working in the areas of sanitation, biodiversity and energy was contracted by WASCO to implement the Marcel Waste Water Project Works 1 which has the three components, the baseline survey, community mobilization, and construction. The baseline assessment involves collection of data by the enumerators who go from door to door about the sanitation situation in these four areas of Marcelo City Council. The second part which is community mobilization, involves raising awareness and educating the communities about hygiene. The last part is construction, which involves construction of the on-site sanitation facilities. Waste <laughs> Project. This project is funding 3,100 trailers for people who cannot afford to have any sanitation facility. In Marcelo City Council area 1 North, the baseline survey has been completed and community mobilization is ongoing with construction 
do to start. In the next three areas, the project is yet to kickstart. Works contract 2 includes the construction of the new Acre College wastewater treatment works to service some of the northern and the southeastern parts of Maseo, as well as upgrades to the existing Rajamasi wastewater treatment works. The Acre College wastewater treatment works was constructed in 2010 and was completed in September 2011. The first purpose was to connect Queen Mamahat Memorial Hospital and in 2013 the residential houses were then connected. In this treatment plant uh, we have three, which is the first one is that one of the mechanical treatment, the second biological treatment and then the third one is the disinfection and then the first one, which is the mechanical treatment, it is consists of uh, the screening and the grid removal. In the, in the screening, we get rid of the papers and all the, the debris that can be dropped by our fine screens. At the, grid at the grid chamber, we are getting rid of the grid to make sure that we avoid abrasion into our system and, the, and to protect our pumps. So from there, we can go on to the second one, which is the biological treatment, where we will be <coughs> actually using the, 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 the microorganisms in, that are naturally in, in the wastewater to digest the organic matter just by supplying them with enough oxygen. So that is where we form the, 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 the frogs, meaning we, 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 we make the, the, solid, the, 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 the solid particles be much more bigger so that they can be able to settle. So then moving on from there, after the water is overflown to the SST, then at the SST they will be settling and then that settled sludge, the portion of it is recirculated back into the system when the other portion is pumped out to the sludge treatment drying beds. Then whatever the, the water then will overflow out via the v at the SST to what we call the polishing pond. We have still some solids in, the, in, 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 in our effluent. So this is why we give it that another time to, for it to settle in the, in the polishing pond. So from there, from the polishing pond, we have the, the chlorination. And from the chlorination, then we go out to, to, to the stream, depending on the level of the of the river, of the water in the river, we let the, the water just over to overflow to the river or we pump it down to the to the abstraction of the potable water. Works contract three comprises the construction of sewer networks and pumping stations in the Agri College area. This network of about 4,172 households will then be connected or serviced at the Agri College wastewater treatment plant. Included in the contract is the construction of the Masuwe wastewater treatment works as a component that complements Rajamose wastewater treatment plant by servicing some of the southern areas of Maseru and the construction of the sewer network in the same area. We have two projects. The first project name is uh, Masuwe Wastewater Project, uh, uh, sewer line and pump station for uh, Kubeswana area uh, in the town. Another one, Lot 2, uh, Lot 2, uh, Hatesani and uh, Hatesani and Masuwe site. After the finalization of this works contract, a network which will serve up to 5,200 households will have been reticulated. With the finalization of the sewer lines in the respective areas, Wasco invites all the residents to connect to their sewer network. Moreover, the completion of Works Contract 1 with baseline survey, community mobilization, and the construction of 3,100 sanitation facilities, as well as the conversion of VIP latrines to water closets, will be achieved. This project includes other service contracts beyond the three Works Contracts among which the development of the sanitation master plan for the next 20 years have been drawn, with the idea to result in the sewer network connection rate of 80% across Maseru. With the support of the European Union, European Investment Bank and the Government of Lesotho, together with the implementing institution WASCO, Maseru is heading towards a healthier future with improved sanitation for everyone.